with filming this through my dipstick camera with my uh, iPhone at the moment. Here's how I diagnose a blown head gasket. This is a 2003 Honda Element. This is cylinder three with a blown head gasket. And I'll get you some other pictures from the side. It's blown in cylinder two and cylinder three. Okay, so here you go again. You can see the leaking down. That's the uh, cylinder head. And right where it's leaking is a gasket. And you can see on the right side of the screen, it's running down the cylinder wall. It's a blown head gasket. So a very simple way to check is to pull your spark plugs out. Get yourself a camera like this. I highly recommend this depth stack. It has a uh, camera on the side and on the bottom. And it's a very clear image. Uh, it's perfect for diagnosing stuff like this. I highly recommend it. So what you need is a camera like that. I'll put a link in the description. And you need a pressure tester, a radiator pressure tester like this. Okay, it doesn't have to be Matco. There's a ton of other brands. I'm sure you could rent them from your local hardware store. I got a good one just because you want to make sure that the tool is not what's leaking when you do pressure testing and stuff anyway. Um, so this Matco one's a very good one. However, what you're going to want to do is you need an adapter kit, and I'll show you some of these. But you pressurize your coolant system. You take out your spark plugs and you put a camera down in here like that. And you can see clearly the uh, coolant running down the inside. This, this motor has a blown head gasket. As you can see, there it is one more time. That's after the puddle running down the cylinder wall. And that's it all pooling up on the top of the piston there. Um, yeah, classic blown head gasket. So I will put links in the description of all the tools I'm using here in case you guys want to use them. Uh, it's a very, very simple check, as long as that's where your head gasket is blown from, in fact. Uh, yeah, I am also going to uh, post some pictures and videos off of the uh, camera itself, probably in the description box, so you guys can uh, get a feel for the um, clarity of the camera itself. Thanks for watching. Okay, so this is taken after uh, the repair. These are made from, oh, let me see the brand. Doesn't even really say it on here, does it? Automotive tools, it looks like. It looks like there's the, uh, the part number 7057. It's USA Asian Radiator Pressure Tester Adapter. It comes with all of these adapters for various different cars and uh, it works fantastic it comes with a bunch of extra gaskets and stuff and this thing does anything from you know Honda's Toyota's uh, GM's Ford's you have a bunch of thread adapters some twist lock adapters like I said, extra O-rings and grommets. And they'll work with most um, radiator pressure test kits. I know OEM Tools makes one. Um, the one I have is Matco. They make one. There's a bunch of different brands, and I'm sure this kit will work with those. And if I can find this tool again, I'll also link, I'll link all this stuff for all these tools that I used in the description. And uh, if I can't find them, I'm sure you'll be able to find if you're looking for something very similar that will do the same thing. This is a fantastic kit, fantastic set, and I highly recommend it.